How's everyone doing today? We have two fake Pokemon packs. We will have one with the Machoke and another one with the with a Pokemon. I have no idea who it is. Sorry. Blame me. Blame me. Anyways, um they both say like uh, let me let me focus on the focus attack thingy. They say X and Y flash fire and they also say pre release. These are all fake. I knew when I saw them that they're fake. You know, there was no surprise. The back, I guess, it has generic stuff and it tells you that you get like certain. Oh, come on, Zoomy. Come on, focus. It says, um, let me read it for you. I'll get the other one so I can read it from that one. All right. Clouds gather, energy crackles, and when you play TCG, a new force will be felt as the temp. The Tempest team makes its debut. All must make ready for a new battlefield featuring electrifying team game changing trainer cards and teams such as Articuno EX, Zapdos EX, and Lugia EX. My my personal thought is why the old why the why the first and second gen Pokemon? But whatever. Let's open up Machoke. Okay, hold on, let me move the mic over here, perfect. Anyways, the you got the Machoke. This is like a cardboard, I think it's a sticker, I'm not sure, who knows. We have Pansage, uh, looks decent. By, it looks decent, I mean, um, it looks kind of like a Pokemon card, except the colors are all cheap ink. Soul Rock, and if you can see the bottom, it's like cut, like it's cut, like they didn't really bother doing the borders. You got Del Fox. This is, I think, a rare. Another Soul Rock, Pan Sage, Trainer Caseus, Ekans, Ultra Ball, Fairy Garden, Dodrio, Energy, Special Energy, Rumble Energy, Ultra Ball, Ekans, Trainer Caseus, Sue Shine, or Suicune, Moon, Muna. Silver Bangles, another one, Muna, Dunsparce, and Squirtle. I think I should be more closer. I think like, the other one will be more closer, don't worry. So there you go. Um, as you can see the back, all of the backs are upside down. That's what it might that's what it probably looks like. Yep. All the backs are upside down. And, and same thing with the front one. The border is like really cut off on the side. It's like they didn't really bother cutting it or printing it right. But overall, the cards, you know, they look like cards. But the only thing is, is not just because the border cuts, but also because they use like the cheapest ink possible. I've used cheap, cheap ink before. And let me tell you, um, yeah, cheap ink looks nasty. That's what it is. All right, we got this guy. I have no idea who he is. We got Gray Ninja. Oh man, my I'm getting, I'm getting cramped while trying to do this. Okay. Okay, Gray Ninja. Looks cool. It's all terrible ink, as you can see. All terrible. But overall, same thing with these ones. Upside down, borders are cut. Volcarona, Brexian, Porygon 2. Sorry if I mispronounced other Pokemon. The only Pokemons I know are from 1 through 4 gen. Mr. Mine, Volcarona, Grey Ninja, a Water Energy, Axu, Fletch Finder, no, Fletch Cinder, Siggy Glyph, I can't even say that, Trainer Muscle Band, Remo Raid, another Muscle Band, Root Fossil, Lee Leap, Fletch Cinder, G Booster. Whoa, man, it's 200. God, that's crazy. Lil Lumu Muse. Malamar. Another G Booster. Another. Is that how you say it? Lil Moose. Another Mammalar. Root Fossil Trainer. And another Suicune. Come on. It seems like every pack has Suicune. Um, you know, Psychic Energy, Energy, Psychic Energy. So there you go. There you have it. These are all fake Pokemon cards. How much did I pay for these? I paid more than I should have. 
I paid around two bucks a pack. That is pretty much of a ripoff. But hey, you know, it was just a, it was just an experience, I guess. Just to get them. But I'm pretty sure I can sell these for a dollar back. Oh yeah, go on. Gonna try to sell them back. Anyways, these are the, my fake Pokemon cards that I'm not gonna have for very long. I'll probably make a video where I burn them. But you know, that's like burning money because I wasted money on them. So yeah, anyways, thanks for watching. Until then, I'll see you guys.